common online marketing mistakes. True, the internet has definitely made it easier and cheaper for us to market our businesses. We can put up sites, send out emails and invites, and create web pages that help us get our products and services out there. However, some marketing strategies are best left alone. Quick Fix SEO Techniques SEO is the best, easiest, and cheapest way to get people to visit your site. This works by boosting up your site's ranking or position on search engines like Google and Yahoo. There are a lot of companies that can help you with your SEO needs. You even might have received emails from a few of these companies, promising that they can boost your visibility. Sometimes, small business owners just let these companies take care of their site's ranking. This works, but might just backfire since the owners do not understand what they are dealing with. Small business would get more value and better outcome if they get companies that can coach and explain these SEO practices to them. The social media guru if you hired a blogger, like someone who has a well-known blog, and expect this person to be a social media guru, that you could have just made a big mistake. Most of the time, bloggers are just people who know how to make interesting articles and post about certain topics. Like the Quick Fix SEO solutions, this will work in the beginning, but may not be a good idea for long-term online marketing strategies. The blogger will have other things to blog about, and content will not be consistent. The better action is to get a team that can work on implementing a long-term, consistent, sustainable online marketing strategy for your web content, blogs, etc. You and your team's online marketing effort and content creation should take the inherent organizational strength into thought, thinking that web developers and designers are experts in marketing the people who make your website will definitely give you a good result. However, do not assume that once this site is up and running, you will start being noticed. We're talking about software engineers and programmers here, not marketing experts. They could make you a very interesting, one-of-a-kind site, but you have due to your part in making sure the site catches the eyes of your customers and potential clients. The best thing to do is to talk to the people making your site. Tell them what you want and what you do not want and ask for advice on how you can get more traffic to your site. 